filling up the car is quickly costing us more. I mean, we have to pay it. And for visitors like Mari Lacero from Boston. It's really surprising to see this price. I would have thought it would have been super low, like 240. Low it is not. Idaho gas stations are cashing in. Yeah, they're making money. I mean, Just in time for the total solar eclipse. Supply and demand, like, it's, a, I guess, a good business trick, but it's not really fair. AAA Oregon, Idaho says an increase in visitors to the gym state is what's driving up the demand, but this is not a true case of supply and demand. There are no real supply side issues, but what you will see is this abundance of demand more than you would typically see, and for that reason, you're bound to have additional price pressure. While the price at the pump is up, crude oil prices are actually down, remaining steady at just under $48 since the start of the month. There's room for a little bit of opportunism as far as the retailer is concerned. The opportunism likely isn't going anywhere when the crowds leave. AAA says to expect the price to remain above average through Labor Day. Compared to the prices we've been paying just a few years ago, relatively speaking, this is a price that's much better than what we had. Which makes filling up at a higher price all that more frustrating for visitors like Lucero. And I think the solar eclipse is great, but it's, you know, I hope the community is excited for people to come and visit and not just taking advantage of the, you know, the fact that people have to get gas.